from London, England, Julia! The WWE Universe already reaching a fever pitch upon their arrival, and we are just seconds away from a highly anticipated match. She is physically and mentally prepared for the task at hand in tonight's match. Taking a moment to get pumped off of this crowd's incredible energy. You can tell she wants to put an end to this. Up across the shoulders. Sidewalk slam. Turn the lights out. Good night. Scooped up. Look out. Mention up. She's about to rise up to something catastrophic. A uh, pump handle here. And they call that the better end. Roll the credits. This one's done. Two. And that's all she wrote. Here is your winner, Julia. Cementing their name after that match. Definitely earning those accolades with that win. She came into this match with one thing on her mind. And would you look at that? It came to fruition. A self-proclaimed prodigy. Well, it's time to prove it tonight. And from Laredo, Texas, the NXT Women's Champion, Roxanne Perez. Before she turned 21 years old, she had already won the first ever NXT Women's Breakout Tournament and the NXT Women's Tag Team Titles. And she has a bright, bright future. the first superstar to compete on SmackDown, who was born after it premiered. Well, you're older than television itself, so I'll take your word for it, Saxton. A self-proclaimed prodigy. Well, it's time to prove it tonight. And from Laredo, Texas, the NXT Women's Champion, Roxanne Perez. Before she turned 21 years old, she had already won the first ever NXT Women's Breakout Tournament and the NXT Women's Tag Team Titles. And she has a bright, bright future. The first superstar to compete on SmackDown, who was born after it premiered. Well, you're older than television itself, so I'll take your word for it, Saxton. Oh, 
Women's division action underway. This is a non-title match, folks. Yeah, but while the title may not be up for grabs here, everyone in the locker room has been buzzing about this one. The challenger has her eyes laser focused on being the one to take down the champ. And tonight could be the beginning of the end. If she's able to knock off the champ in this one, that could absolutely open the door for a future title shot. She'll be facing Roxanne Perez, who really took that long way to WWE and honed her teeth on the independent scene. That is not a path that teaches you how to quit easily. To the sky! Diving foot stomp! Brutal! Oh, able to counter. Roxanne Perez has a lot of fighting spirit. What's the best method to counter that drive? There's no doubting Perez's heart, but she can come up short in terms of size and strength. Keep the pressure on her, and you'll ultimately be able to wear her down. Here, pull that slam! Dodge oh, kick! Looking bad for her here. And the forearm smash! Can she do it here? Stop the ref count before two. Getting the shoulder up before two tells me the end is not near. Suplex! Devastating. Right to the spine. And now she's looking to go top rope. She's getting back up, but she might be down again soon. Soaring. She certainly took a chance there. High risk with no reward. No, oh, someone call a dentist. Knee strike connects. Producing a trampling. Perez caught by surprise. She's able to get out of the way. Building a back with force. Roxanne escapes the attack. German suplex. She's starting to drag a little bit. And Devastating clotheslines and the calf kick. She's going for it. No, two count. She just will not go away. Ah. And that one misses the mark. And that failed to hit the mark. And Roxanne being aligned into position. Up in the fireman's carry. Slam! Wow! Awesome. Perez makes a cover after that. And this one is over. Here is your winner, Julia! This was not the way Roxanne Perez wanted this night to end. As always, Cole, you're more polite than I am, so I'll just say what we're all thinking. This was as one-sided as it gets.